Hey y'all, I'm Senator Blake Tiller with the week two Senate in a minute for 2019. This week was budget week. We combed through the $27 billion budget proposal of Governor Kemp. It saw some increases in some strategic areas that you may have already heard about. Education increased roughly 1% mainly due to increase in teacher pay. You've heard the governor talk about wanting to eventually raise teacher pay $5,000 per teacher. This would raise it roughly $3,000, a significant down payment on where he's already told us he already wants to go. You also saw $30,000 per each school for school safety. That's to help harden schools so that we can make sure when students go to school to learn, they also come home safe and sound as well. The governor put $8.4 million in this budget for mental health to try to address problems of high school students before they become issues that we're hearing about on the front page. That's just a few of the items. There are significantly more. We're going to be coming through this over the next couple of weeks, and we'll probably do more things to break this down more. I've asked the Senate Press Office to give you a couple of graphs to show you what the FY 2019 budget was under Governor Deal and how that has changed now in the FY 2020 budget. You'll see certain areas increase. You saw education increase. You'll see certain areas decrease. But just because there's been a decrease there doesn't mean that there's been a decrease in dollars. Remember, those are just decreases in percentage. As you see that growth in the education budget, it's going to mean that other parts of that 100% pie shrink. But compare the 2019 dollars to the actual FY 2020 dollars and see that those areas are still seeing growth as well. And, and why is this? Well, one reason is we're a growing state. We're still a growing state. I want you to watch that education budget though because what you're going to see and what we heard this week is we actually are now having a flat line in, in Georgia students. Our high school population is not growing. Our K-12 population is not growing anymore. We're going to have to watch increases in that area particularly strong over the next few years because we're not increasing in the growth in those areas. Um, there will be many thing, more things to talk about over the next few weeks. I, I look forward to talking with you more about the budget and other items you're going to see. Please feel free to still contact me. 404-656-0089 or online at blake.tillery at senate.ga.gov. Thank you again, and that's uh, week two for Senate in a Minute.